What's up, guys? Southern Outcast, and um, I've got a review for y'all today. Let me just. Um, now this is a a um, soft plastic coloring company, or not um, like a dyeing company. I don't know what to call it, but um, what they do or what happens is. One second, just grabbing all the stuff. But, um, so, what they sell, or they sell, it's, the company is Spike It. They, um, they sell their dye in markers. They, it, it is like a dip and glow marker. Um, it, um, gives, like, a bright color and, um, will give a garlic smell. It's, like, really strong. You can check it, you can buy them at Walmart, Cabela's. I think Walmart. Yeah. Because I got this stick at Walmart, which will be in a giveaway pretty soon. So check it out. We're just going to be testing out some lures with this. Yeah, here's one with the hook. So, um, I like to use them, especially the chartreuse on maybe like a white minnow or, or a white um, swim bait. Um, my swim bait review um, has chartreuse on it. Go check it out. Um, but I'm just gonna start off with something. Let me find some oil or something. Okay, here we go. Here's a little brush on now. These brush hogs. I'm not gonna do the dip because it can kind of get messy. But um, these brush hogs are really good. I'm just gonna. So what I will do is um, say say um, there's um, a bedding fish. I will use either the red or the orange, and I will just um, let me get a paper towel to go under this or a towel. Um, so what I'll do is I will just kind of color the ends with like some streaks or something. And pretty much just design it how I think we'll catch fish. Like maybe just one brush side or both brush sides or chartreuse on the tails. Or um, I just finish this up and I'll show you kind of what I did. Then I'll test it out in the tank. Now that's good for the red. Now I'm just going to add some chartreuse to the tails. Now, okay, so I got it finished. Now, I'm not going to put, put the camera in the tank, but I'm just going to kind of let you watch and see about how this lure looks. Um, let's see. Right there. Okay, now I'm just going to kind of dip it in and kind of just show you. Now, see, you can tell by the chartreuse tails and the red thing. So now it'll kind of, now that will really get the bass attention. You drop it in a bed or something and you're like definite, um, definite sh reaction strike. So, and the smell helps them keep it in their mouth. Um, but you can put it on like any bait or lure or I mean soft plastic so I hope you could see that all right now I use these pretty much in murky water in um, in all kinds of different um, water clarities um, I also use them a ton in spawning or on swim baits and when um, I'm not really I'm getting bites but they're not really taking it all the way um, I'll put some on it to make sure they hold it a little bit longer. Um, 
I will be, I don't know if I'll have a head-to-head -head against JJ's Magic, but um, I'd like to, I don't know. It's just really strong garlic. It's, it's like, it's bad almost. Don't spill it in your room or on anything because it's pretty bad. So, thanks for watching. I really like the, the Spike It, and um, stay tuned for more videos like this and uh, reviews. And this is probably like, I don't know, but if you, uh, this is probably um, the only glow thing or um, lure customization I actually like believe in or stuff. So, um, go get you some. Um, you can um, get them at Walmart, Cabela's. Um, I would definitely look into buying some. And um, just stay tuned for more videos. And thanks for watching. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. And tight lines out there.